Hey, swag, swag. Watch the V go zoom, zoom. Watch me turn up the spot in the room. Turn it up. All these hits and we just got the zoom. What's up, everyone? Welcome to NBA 2K21, my career mode, episode 22, Los Angeles Lakers. Uh, 54 wins, 10 losses versus the Nets. 36 wins, 28 losses. And this game will be played in the Staples Center. Please like the video, leave a comment, share this video on social media, click that bell, subscribe if you want to help us hit 2,000 subs here on YouTube, guys. Um, webcam will be returning soon, guys. I, I just saw... A couple hours ago, I just saw the new Elgato uh, face cam. Uh, it's apparently a, a camera that's uh, 1080p, 60 frames per second. And uh, webcam will return when I buy that. And uh, let's just say soon, guys. But uh, guys, today's video is going to be really cool. But um, hope you guys enjoy it. Please check out the link below in the description where you can check out all the links that are on social media. Go down in the com. Go down below in the description to find those links and also you can find a playlist of the series but guys it's the last episode for um for for uh, tomorrow which will be july the 17th 2021 so ladies and gentlemen let's get this video started so obviously you guys are watching a pre-recorded video let me just say that um yesterday yesterday i did talk about um in today's video which is uh going to be released at july on July 16th, 2021. That's obviously going to be a video where I talk about, um, let's talk about legacy series. So legacy series is our series that are not officially retired unless the series is ended or unless I want to end it on my choice or the fans want me to end it or whatever. But guys, let's do this game. Hey, that's off and, um, the tip. I did well, play a game, but I lost. Now I didn't really show wall. it because, uh, what advice would you give those in that, in that video, I didn't show it. I didn't want to show it because it was a really oh, bad man. loss. Just uh, make sure you get your rest when you're and home, try to get away from the game as much as possible. Just Stay Irving. in the gym and work out as much as possible, but uh, when you're out in the gym, try to get away from the game. And, uh, and, and guys, today I want to just to uh, confirm that we are 90 overall. He just as we speak, we are, if we just reached 90 overall, that is such a go-to move for him. He holds nothing back on those. The shot by LaVert, no good. Going inside, and there's the slam dunk to finish it off. Well, tally up another helper for Rondo. I mean, he just keeps. And now I did, I did up my overall, and I only have 2K uh, BC left, but I just upped it. Levert outside. Irving with it, and it's Howard picks him up defensively. It's tipped, and he gets it back. Howard, one of the most feared rim protectors in the league. I'll tell you what, it's good to be his age. Yeah, I don't have memories like that at my age, though. <laughs> now here's Irving. Consistent production from him. Averaging around 27 Irving and looks, a half points a game. Did Durant injure like that? Outside for LeVert. Let's it go from deep. He can't hit that time. And the Lakers will go the other way with it. They traveled to Brooklyn last time they faced the Nets. Came away with a win. They beat this team last time largely because of the massive free throw disparity. Well, it tells you a lot about who is the more aggressive team. I mean, they should have that same exact attitude tonight. Here's Irving following the score by the Lakers. Levert outside. Five to shoot. Pass to Prince to halt the run. LeBron with the rebound. Good of the shooter as he is, it drives him crazy to miss a wide open three like that. Guarded by Durant. It's okay. The Nets have gone just one of six to begin the he game. He only missed one shot today. Here's Levert. His last he had 24 points. Here's Irving. And so far in this one, two for four. Now, I noticed they updated the roster. James Harden should be on the team, right? Playing to his strengths. And there's the drive. <laughs> Attacking the rim with power. Tremendous finish. Brooklyn has gone only one of four from three-point land. Oh. 
Rebounded by Rondo. Man, you don't see this fella blow many layups. Not against D like that anymore. And he drops in the layup off the glass. He's nice got throw. 12. <laughs> this run has been fueled by their Matador defense. For Brooklyn, they've gone 2 of 8 shooting the ball. They've been having major problems offensively. Definitely in a bit of a dry spell. Allen finds Irving. Another miss by Irving. Given his range, you'd expect him to capitalize on that opening. Well, Kyrie Irving, the former top pick from that incredible basketball program at Duke University, uh, he has grown as a player since he first came into the league, and he has become much smarter with his shots. He knows when to pick his spots out there on the court. Now here's Durant. Now quiet so far offensively, searching for his first points of the game. He's checked by Levert. And that one is stuffed right through. You know you're doing something right when you find yourself up double digits in the first period. Yeah, true. But now it's about sustaining their energy and maintaining the focus. Here's Irving. 27 points his last game. Goes to the reverse layup and drops it in. Irving's got seven points. And with the shot selection of Irving, the last few seasons have been his most efficient as a player. You know, B.A., it, it seems like Kyrie figured out what works best for him. He's matured as a player and knows how to make the most of his chances. This is him distilling the best parts of his offensive arsenal. The shot by LeVert, no good. Here are the Lakers now. They're on an 18-4 run. Pass to Davis. James, outside. He's checked by Levert. Goes back up. Oh, denied by Durant. But Durant has arms that just keep on going and going and going. You aren't going to be able to just get a shot by him. Allen, the pass to Irving. Allen, who is Allen? Who the hell is Allen? Back to I Allen. looked that up. That's a good question. It's Levert the Allen? wing. Puts it up from 17. And after missing his first three shots, he drains it. One for four. Well, you can learn a lot by watching him operate in their offense. Takes it inside. Drops it hard with one hand. Wow, he makes it look easy. Building a big advantage early with a terrific all-around performance. Well, who the hell is Irving, though? Gauge. I know who Kyrie Irving is, guys. I'm, I'm talking. Don't, don't listen to me. I know who Kyrie Irving is. I don't, I don't even know why they tell me. It's one of my friend's favorites, by the way. Bring that back. It's been a long just, time just since I brought that back in this video. Allen with a screen on James. Yeah, yeah, it's open. Slammed in by Durant. And every step of Durant on the drive covers so much ground. You know he's looking to finish that play with the dunk. Ooh, good that shit pissed Irving. me off when I missed my Brooklyn shot. Trailing. Hey, we can't do everything right. Here's Levert. Block. And it goes out of bounds. That one off Howard. The Lakers. It's out, it's out. And a change for the Nets. Denwitty's checked in. Shot from the inbound. Out to the wing. Here's Prince. Yes. And Prince. a nice assist from Denwitty. It's a cool name. He's consistent from out there, especially when you give him that kind of room. Oh, nice one-handed jam there, B.A. Hey, a little exclamation point. Now here's Irving. He's got seven. Pass to Durant. Over James. Durant's shot is off. He expects to make every one of those. Durant used to be good. To make them too. Just that. Slams. They've controlled the paint so far. That's been the difference. Well, you think defensively that you try to pack in the lane. I mean, but that, then that opens up some opportunities for their shooters. Now here's Allen. Eight points in his last timeout. Shot blocked. And you mentioned McGee's outstanding lift. There, Dude, I wasn't. I thought, he he I thought it was over. I was like, what? Shot. I'm that's really why, that's why I just stopped. Like, recognizing there's more room outside and inside. 
They've shown so much energy right from the start, particularly on the offensive end. Yeah, they've been very aggressive, and they've taken early control of this game. Now here's Durant. Coming off a 12-point game. And again, Brooklyn with the triple. I mean, it is insane that Durant shoots from behind the arc like it's a free throw. Just an easy motion from him that deep. Oh, he powers right through the defender. Ah, yeah. Y'all want to play ball? Or just foul off there? Ooh, I'm doing whatever. Go just let line. me know. It goes on Kyrie Irving. And the Lakers with some changes. Morris, he's checked in for Anthony Davis. Kuzma comes in for LeBron. And Beasley has subbed in for Rondo. Brooklyn with the ball. The Lakers getting their last shot to go. Durant on the attack. And it's slammed in by Durant. It's I'm insult sure right here, bro. To as a it's insult. Drives. I'm just glad I never have to deal with it. Drives to the hoop. Oh! Throw it down! That type of finish is just deflating right now for a team that's trying to make a comeback. Ouch. That's certainly a big-time finish right there. It was one big exclamation point, or maybe even a question mark. Here's Durant following the score by the Lakers to the paint. Oh, deflected. McGee with a steal. Oh, it's stolen by Jordan. It's blocked. And they get it back. Yep, that one's good. So far, rebounding has been a focal point for them. Going inside, lays it up and banks it in. 32 points in the game for him. Man, that's now 10 straight points in the paint. I'm not sure what's happened to their defense, man. Dinwiddie with it. He had a 21-point out again their last game against Chicago. I mean, and you look at his free throw numbers, and this shows you how much pressure he put on the defense. Unable to get that one. And Brooklyn will go the other way. With let's it. go. This game coming after let's a loss go, versus the Bulls. Go, let's go. Yeah, they made a lot of plays and they were in it until the end. Just couldn't do let's enough go, to get the go, win. Yeah, and sometimes it just comes down to a couple of critical plays which you need to execute in close, ugly games. Now here's Harris. He's been productive, averaging just over seven points a game. It was a strong. Like he's strong. He's strong. Constant. Nah, he ain't gonna hit this. He's gonna miss. Watch. And Harris drops them both. The Lakers in the lead. He takes it in. And he jams it home with authority. Oh, just an artful little reverse slam. Mm, power and style. That was sweet. Dinwiddie outside. Durant way outside. And again, it's the Nets missing. Pounded by Harris. Earning his money on the interior tonight. That's a nice move. And for the Nets, they're shooting only 37% early. Then when he finds Harris. Driving inside. And it's in there. Harris has got six. I like that pick play. I mean, you can see how easily it makes it for him to get to the cup. And he bangs it home with one hand. And breaking out the one-hand slam. Man, an emphatic way to extend the lead a little more. Pass to Dinwiddie. The Lakers with a rebound. McGee's got five rebounds tonight. Well, he has to work harder to get a good high percentage look. I mean, he's been taking some bad shots. Connects from downtown. And just not letting up at all. I mean, you have to love this approach. You want to get the ball to the guys who make plays. You have to go to your best scores. I mean, it's a smart strategy. And so far, it's paying off in this game. Reading the trajectory of that shot, he anticipated the big rebound. Pounded by Harris. And it's Kevin Durant with the foul. That's his first. I stay good with the team. Durant. I stay good with the team. You already know I stay good with the team. Why did I have to sit on the side bench half of the second quarter? It's done. What's the pick? What's the pick? Come on, yes. teammate.
They know he's won some MVPs in the NBA Finals, of course, and he's played that. big on that Score stage that. in the playoffs. But he's never won Score a regular that. season MVP. We all say he's the best two-way player, perimeter player in the league, and he's done it for the last few years at such a high level. But what's interesting, he may never get it because he's really a implemented this low shot. management model to his season, which may hinder his ability to one day win a regular season MVP. We've got Rajon Rondo. Anthony Davis is out there with JaVale McGee. Then there's LeBron James. That's the Laker five. We're going to see how the Browns led the league in swats. Not only the wingspan, but the awareness. If they close this win out, I know who my MVP is. His offensive performance tonight has been unreal. Offensively, it's been a struggle for him. Yeah, they need to string together some shots to have any kind of chance. And a foul hey, D, on the D, what the hell are you doing, bro? Are we nervous, bro? Are we nervous? Dude, that's how, that's how I last came back. I know you faced Kobe Bryant a lot over the years. What's the main thing you'll remember about him? Well, B.A., there's so much to remember about the late, great Kobe Bryant. The buzzer beaters, the excellence, uh, the, the dedication and focus he brought to his entire career. But the thing that's beautiful about Kobe's journey is him starting off as a young man, trying to find his way, at times struggling, endearing himself to his teammates. And as he went through his career, the ball that time. he really became the elder statesman, the big brother. His influence on today's players was just incredible. And I, I think it was just a beautiful story. I'm being a slam dunk contest from next start year. To finish. No. Uh, what an incredible ambassador for the game. What an incredible leader in the game of basketball. And he's someone that we all Okay, that's all right, bro. Today. That's all right. Don't, well, don't keep blaming me. This quarter, taking it on himself to guide their offense. With the drive. And down it goes. Two points. Yeah, their defense is starting to wear down. That's three straight buckets at the rim. Now Irving, nine points in the game. Pass to Levert. Oh, he took a hard foul. I'm at it. Oh, well, that's a break. I want in that foul. Wow. They're going early, ref. They don't want to win that bad. And he sinks the second. Los Angeles has gone 0 for 4 from beyond the arc here in the second quarter. He's been playing great unselfish basketball. Really putting the rock in the hands of the right shooters. Yeah, he's just not giving the ball up. He's passing with a purpose. And this lead the scores. Irving for three. Called in by McGee. McGee's got rebound number eight here already in the game. You have to credit their effort. I mean, they've done an amazing job on the glass. I mean, this could end up being a big night for him. I mean, if this quarter is any indication... A difficult situation for Brooklyn. Outside Irving. Here's Levert. Rebound by the Lakers. They couldn't put the pieces together last time out. Losing to the Clippers. Yeah, we know that on the road, you're already a little out of your element. Then the misses from the line become contagious. And then it starts to become a mental block. Uh, you start to think, oh, I hit the ram. Because, uh... All day, son. All we just got to keep our working. Were restricted. Instead, a lot of video chat interviews and even IQ tests. Players completing timed exercises, testing their memory and skills. Whether or not you believe the game is 90% mental, it's obviously an important component. It truly is. Thanks, Allie. Good stuff. Irving, no good. He's gone off the rails this quarter. This is a bad time to do it. I mean... With their needing to fight from behind. Oh gosh! Out of play, the Nets will have it. Let me know walk up. Oh crazy! I my crazy ass bro. I Brooklyn. walked out of bounds. My bad. And here is Irving. Nine points in the game. Shoots over Rondo. Here's Jordan and slam dunk by Jordan. Jordan he turns the offensive board into a big slam. Jordan. Wow, he was so Ooh. well positioned there. Credit his anticipation. Yes, it's good. Yeah, one foul. That's all right. Ways to get the I get my B average paint. back soon. Five consecutive buckets. 
Levert outside. Pass to Prince. Prince. Now Irving for three. Doesn't go for him. And they're up considerably a rebound. because of their efforts Defensive on the glass. Rebound. Driving in. Brooklyn with the board. Dinwiddie's got his fourth rebound in this one. Paint. And he gets it to go. He's putting the hammer down. Dominant quarter for him. Trying to push out that lead. Well, the Nets shooting only 31% in the game. Irving, the pass to Dinwiddie. Dude, we're, we're, we're coming straight off a loss, guys. If you're wondering what happened, pass to Prince. I didn't do the... I didn't do the Los Angeles uh, the Clippers game. I skipped it, he shoots it instead of doing it. Rondo gets the bucket. And uh, it wasn't you guys' fault. It was just like I didn't want to do it because there was some trickery going on. It was a loss. And I just felt like, nah, Reserving. we're not going to record that. In the game. It was nasty. It's because our teammates were getting away with a lot Levert of that. Passes to Dinwiddie. Rebound collected by Anthony Davis. Los Angeles has gone 0 for 4 from beyond the arc here in the second quarter. How about Spencer Dinwiddie? What the? I got you, man. The NBA. He didn't get a lot of chances as the 38th pick Green. in the 2014 draft, Grant. And what's fascinating, B.A., is Dinwiddie looked like an end Dude, they gave us more control off camera if you're wondering what happened. Years. And then all of a sudden, something clicked. He's been a scoring threat ever since. He plays fearless with the right, ball in so his hands and never second here. guesses his ability. Get that in there. And that one drops. We've Let's seen go. that more than once today. An effortless basket inside. They need something good to happen here. Yeah, they've gone way too long without a score. Irving finds Dinwiddie. Back to Irving to stop the run. Howard grabs the miss. Howard's got his Thank you, Howard, bro. Thank you, Howard. Shot them Thank you, Howard. The foot with his inability to make shots tonight. All right. Offensive rebound. Okay. Get out of here. Pounded by Harris. Yep, that one goes. It's been a clinical performance. He's played a huge role and, and has them in position to grab. Can't believe I hit get 90 overall today. It's crazy. There's a minute 40 left in the Next second. Next up, 95 overall. Pass to Jordan, bro. Back to Irving. Six on the shot clock. And again, no good by Brooklyn. His field goal percentage has dipped this quarter. I mean, his movement yeah. has to be better. He has to find the open the spots on the floor. Fuck ass game, bro. Harris outside. Jordan with it. Man, slam dunk by Jordan. We can't ass game. You know what? I was. Coach, what was the point? What were you trying to get to? Is there a point you was trying to get to with this or? This is just like you sent me on the bench because I wasn't doing correctly nothing. I wasn't clicking right, right? Was it? Was that the reason? I think it was because I wasn't clicking right. You know, threw my ass on the bench. Probably right. what happened here. Yeah. I'm assuming it was that. Okay. So it's the Lakers now on the floor for the Nets. Irving and Levert at the one and the two. Then there's Kevin Durant. Then it's Jared Let's Allen. Make sure we don't excellent run out to pain on the these guys. Slot. Their interior D continues to look shaky. Vincent rebounds. Not a good we got two. For them right uh, now. Brooklyn with the ball. The Lakers getting their last shot to go. Pass to Durant. And it's Kevin Durant with the foul. Yeah. That's Kevin Durant, you can't do that. I love great defense. Just quick to establish his feet and he takes the hit and for the lakers their shooting has been wrong ridiculous 75 percent on this game power down is the whistle that's right Let's keep the ball moving that's boys how you play point forward i know i miss when i'm not here bro i don't understand that not here we're also ever miss do they handler in your day how about now? Who's the best scorer off the bounce in this league? You know, B.A., you would give me that tough question. I mean, that's <laughs> with all the great players in this league who are all very capable off the bounce. My player. Uh, I don't know. I, I my player. Would have to go I'm with good. James Harden. I mean, his ability on the perimeter, handling the basketball, step-back three-pointers, and then, of course, he's so good at crafty with the ball, getting to the basket, drawing fouls. You it. almost just like watching the shooting foul. It's okay, my fault. Prince. 
Nice to meet you. LeBron James on you for a moment. And maybe a, a little hint of Luka Magic as well. They're, they're pretty good, too. That's fair. <laughs> and Brooklyn shooting a low 31%. Their offense is lacking. Irving, the pass to Levert. Shakes him. Basket is good. Nice setup from Irving. Irving's got his fourth assist in this one. I, I love seeing that kind of unselfishness. Irving is going to be a sensational teammate. A big night for him. Most points in the game. And, and they just cannot figure out a way to stop him. And so it's Brooklyn with it. To the left wing. Allen, the pass to Irving. Shoots over Rondo. Irving, no good. For Los Angeles, they've gone three of three in the second half. Here he goes. And he got the whistle on the way. Y'all got to stop following me if you want to stay in this thing. Can't do it. You all are trash. You got nothing. He does not get the second one. Oh, That's how you go. Oh, I was saying that for my team. You go. It's a battle boxing, Howard out. Too big, too strong. See it. The Nets have got two him to three get a from the floor in this third quarter. Outside Durant. Pass to Allen. It's Levert on the wing. He's got five. Here's Prince. Outside Durant. From deep. James with the rebound. James has got five rebounds in the game. Ball stolen. Just under two and a half minutes into this third quarter now. I always Irving call football when I'm down and here. And Rondo picks him up defensively. Pass to Durant. Into the lane. And Durant with the big finish. Somebody needs to block stopping better. Durant when oh. he's on his own. But when he's running the pick and roll like he is, it's pretty much impossible. Hey, how's that for an answer? Right back with the dunk. He always wants to give him some numbers, and tonight he's giving him plenty. Brooklyn with the ball. Levert outside. Here's Irving. Goes up and lays it in nice and easy. Irving's got 13. Oh, you get in inside like this, you're going to get a high percentage shot almost every time. This is what it's been since halftime. Efficient and effective. Oh, just a dream scenario for them so far. Their offense looking like a well-oiled machine. Levert outside. Pass to Allen. Left side Durant from the arc. Another score. His fifth yeah, make out of ten happens. tries. Well, this, this is where Durant feasts. I mean, he, he can let it fly, and, and he has confidence. Oh, nice! Oh. What a jam! Yeah. He's a living highlight reel. Seriously, that could end up being one of the best dunks of the year. Now here's Irving. He's got 13. Up top, Allen. Guarded by Howard. Outside for Levert. Shot clock at five. The three. Rebound by the Lakers. Guarded by Durant. And he dunks it down. Excellent court awareness. James has always had terrific instincts as a playmaker. Irving with it. Pass to Durant. And it's blocked by Davis. Allen defending. Davis down low. Showing some intensity there. I like how Davis attacks the offensive glass and comes up with second chance baskets. Now here's Durant. Oh, and there's the miss it. Miss. Grab that board, grab that board. Well, the length and lateral quickness of Kevin Durant, it's what makes him an impactful player on both ends of the court. And what I love about him, B.A., is that Durant can defend in the paint and on the perimeter equally as well. He also has great timing when challenging shots. And lately, he has received more credit for his defense, but you feel like he's still slipped on just a little bit. Here's Irving. 
The Lakers getting their last shot to go. Now Jordan. It's going to be on LeBron James. That's his first foul of the game. He got it off in time. And no good. Trying to get we that. We got to do the little things and we're going to be fine. Right? Or quarter time. Time to go. Time to go to ham. Time to go ham. Oh. James Bowman going to have second season hopes. I only get to play one minute. That's Let's close this one. Nice to meet you, bro. Sophisticated method of managing players' minutes. I want to hear the Grant Hill thoughts on load management. Well, I'll tell you what, B.A., load management is the new wave in the NBA, and that is so valuable Coach, and important just, sorry, to the team. But not let me play in 82 where games, I was supposed to play. Uh, travel, supposed to play all the fourth getting quarter. in what late happened? at night on the road. What happens, guys though? Guys working out year-round. It's so important to think big picture as players uh, go what throughout happens, their career. So load management and sophistication that's applied now is so important and critical. And I'm a little jealous. I wish they had that back when I played. <laughs> Having players available in crunch time and extending careers. Deion Waiters out there with Alex Caruso. Then there's Kyle Kuzma. Then there's Markeith Morris. That's who's in the game for the Lakers. Now here's Durant. Ooh, pops the J after yeah, a cagey pass. He actually hit that. Durant's got 34 right. points. 43 seconds left in okay. the fourth quarter. I don't, I don't feel comfortable with this, but hey. Here's Caruso. Caruso. Out of bounds. What? It'll go to the Nets. A I was trying to. Substitute. Are you kidding me? Terrible call. Dude, why do they always do that to me? Like, I'm trying to do the, the Stephen Curry uh, challenge. Four seconds left the in the one fourth. where he shoots threes. I, I'm not just Outside doing a foul Milton. turnover to just be doing a turnover. Pass to Luau Cabarro. And the foul is called. He missed on it. Kuzma. Of course it's you, bro. Kuzma, that gets us fouled. Push off this miss. Push off this miss. It's both from the stripe. And he had all of them. 19 seconds left in the final quarter. Got it. Good job in the low post. Stepping up and nailing an important shot to put this away. That's the dagger. You could tell they wanted that one. I know that seals the deal. Because we're still the ball, please. Here's Claxton. And so it's the Lakers easily grabbing this one. Boy, they were something special. They didn't see that. I like the way you ball today, Jay. Uh, good job. Yeah, next time, Junior. They're gonna win the streak with that one. We got a B minus. That's okay. Our last game, Lakers won. We would have got a shooter badge. If it wasn't for those Maryland children. I'm, t I'm talking. I'm listening. So 55 and 10. The next time we meet, we will be taking on the Rockets, um, which that's uh, going to be in the next, I guess, home game. Yeah, next home game. Guys, that video will be coming soon for y'all. Please like the video. Also, feel free to leave a comment. Subscribe if you're new to the channel. Uh, please help us hit 2,000 subs here on YouTube. Please drop a like and uh, click that bell. If you want notifications, check out the links down below in the description down below. Guys, that's going to do it for me today. And remember, episode, well,
episode 23 will be coming soon guys thank y'all very much for watching catch y'all until then bye Thank you.